What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be talking about Bad Batch Season 3, Episode 8, and what potentially is to come. But before we do get into that, remember, hit the subscribe, like, and notification bell. So you're always in the know. Don't forget to have a membership and a merch store. Without further ado, let's get into today's episode. Now, with already being almost halfway done to the Bad Batch Season 3 with Episode 8 story, basically coming to a full end, we know that the Empire is throwing every resource possible at recapturing Omega, especially due to Project Nucromancer. Now, this means that we can expect more skirmishes between the Bad Batch, Clone Force 99, and Empire's Agents of the Shadow Clones that we did see in Episode 7, or the regular Stormtroopers that are under the control of Dr. Hamlock. Now, another possibility is the arrival of the Bounty Hunters teased in the Bad Batch Season 3's trailer, including Cad Bane and Fennec Shen, the leader of whom is now confirmed to be appearing has shared an exclusive first look at episode 8's Bad Territory by comicbook.com, which sees Hunter and Wrecker working directly with Fennec to fight off the alligator-like creatures on an unknown planet. Now, this clip is full of action. Now, we see an alliance between the Bounty Hunter and the members of Clone Force 99, which is going to be interesting to see coming this episode. Now, interestingly enough, Star Wars The Bad Batch Season 3's Episode 7 saw the show's main characters discussing what M-Count means after Omega revealed that it is what Helmlock's testing is surrounded by. Now, despite also being teased in The Bad Batch Season 3's trailer, Asajj Ventress is yet to appear in the series. Given her former Jedi and Sith training in Star Wars Bad Batch Season 3 Episode 8, could finally introduce the character as a way of Clone Force 99, deducing what is meant by M-Count, and thus why Omega is important to Palpatine's sinister plans. But overall, if there were any, any guesses as to what we're going to be getting apart from Fennec Shen in this episode, it is probably the character of Cad Bane as well. I wouldn't really go off and say Asajj Ventress just yet. I think she comes later on in this series as I've talked about it in previous videos in the past before when we did get the trailer drop with Asajj Ventress being confirmed. I personally think that she might inherit Omega and that's how Omega stays in the fight a lot longer and maybe they have bigger plans for Asajj Ventress's character as we do know that Quinlan Voss is still alive in the Kenobi series so they could utilize her character Character, and she might be a character of importance as we do see how much they want to get her back, especially knowing that her midichlorian count is pretty high. But overall, guys, comment down below. Let me know what characters you're excited to see and who you think we'll get in the next episode. For more Star Wars content like this, guys, hit that subscribe, like, and notification bell so you're always in the know. Don't forget to have a membership and a merch store, and I'll catch you guys in the comment section and in tomorrow's video.